Hello everyone. In this tutorial, you will learn how to set up a plugin for SendGrid that allows you to send transaction emails like order shipped, order placed, reset password, and many more. We'll be assuming that you've already set up a Medusa project locally, um, running with a Postgres database and a Redis server. Um, so we're just going to jump straight into the uh, terminal here and install the plugin in a Medusa project. So I'm currently in a Medusa project called Backend here, and I'm going to say yarn at Medusa plugin SendGrid. And that's going to install the plugin. And then we're going to open up the Medusa project here, and we're going to jump into Medusa config, which is where we configure all of our plugins. Now, since this plugin needs options, we need to have a slightly different notation than the one already here. So we're going to say, we need the Medusa plugin SendGrid here, and the plugin needs options. We need an API key. We need to say who actually sent the email. And then finally, we need an order placed template. We can fill out the from field now. Um, I'm gonna send from an email called hello at medusajs.com. Um, but the API key and the auto place template is something that we will be getting from the SendGrid dashboard. So you are required to, to sign up for an account on SendGrid. Um, and then we, when you've done so, and when you've actually verified that you can send emails um, from a specific email, right now I've verified that hello at Medusa.js is allowed to, to send out emails. Um, then you're going to jump into settings. You're going to jump into API keys and then you're going to create a new API key if you don't have one. And then you're going to add that to your project. Now I'll, I've already added this. As you can see, it's created here and I've added it to my .in file and I've called it SendGrid API key and you can do something similar. Now we configured the API key as well. So now the final thing we need to do is we need to actually create a template that gets sent out when orders are placed. So in SendGrid, we're gonna jump into the email API. We're gonna jump into dynamic templates. And then we are gonna create a new dynamic template. We're gonna call this order place. And then we're gonna open up and create our first version of the template here. All right, I'm just going to call this 1.0 here and I'm going to give it a subject called auto place. Thank you. And then we're going to jump into the build section. We're going to throw in a bit of a text, a text field here. And then we're going to say just to test it out, we're going to say order placed with ID. And then we're going to use the handlebars here to use data coming from the Medusa plugin SendGrid. Um, it sends the entire auto object to the SendGrid um, platform here, so you can use the display ID, for example. You can see all of the different fields that are sent. You can find those within the plugin. You can find it in here if you go to order placed data. You can then see all of the different things that we sent. All right. This should be it. I'm going to save this template. I'm going to go back. Just going to make sure it's completely saved here. I'm going to go back and then I'm going to copy the template ID here and I'm going to throw it in our plugin options over here. All right. So now we're ready to go. So I'm going to jump back into my terminal. I'm going to start up my server, which now has Medusa plugin SendGrid installed. And now to test it out, test this out, I've, I am currently running our Gatsby starter locally. So the Gatsby starter Medusa. So we're going to jump into that one over here and then we're going to go through a checkout flow. So I'm going to say I want a pair of shorts here and a size medium. I'm going to go to the checkout flow. I'm going to say send it to support at medusajs.com. I'm going to fill in my address here. All right. I'm going to fill in my number here. I'm going to choose a delivery method. 
And finally, we currently only support test payments, but you can integrate Stripe into your own Gatsby starter if you want to. But now I'm just going to complete this one. I'm going to complete it, and I'm going to jump into my mail program under support at medusajs.com. I'm going to wait for the email to come in. And boom, there we go. We actually have an email coming from hello at medusajs.com, and it says order placed with ID 2. So now you've actually configured SendGrid to send out order placed emails to all of your customers. And you can kind of uh, configure a lot of different things in the Medusa SendGrid plugin. Um, and all of them can be found here. So there's lots of different uh, templates that you, can, that you can add to the plugin uh, by default. Additionally, you also have the opportunity to use the SendGrid service in your own custom project to send out emails directly. Um, this is it.